Fast food restaurant fries. Yes, uh, that is Panda I a, Express. I got another good one. What a burger! Mm. Really, you think so? No, no one else does. Pretty uh, good. Uh, pretty good. In and out. In and out. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to Eat Sleep Nerd. We are continuing our nerdy knockout series with a family feud style episode. We so, are family. Yes. The Nerdy Knockout. It's our competition series. Sometimes we change up the format. This time we're going back to the nerdy feud style of things. So if you've ever seen Family Feud, it's the same idea. But with nerds. But with nerds. In this episode, we're focusing on food. Putting the eat in the Eat Sleep Nerd name. So, I'm your dorky DJ, Corey Winter. The contestants for this episode, we got Josh Winter. So, we got Christian James. Got we got here. Nick Murphy. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, typically, obviously, Family Feud style games are two teams, but we got three teams because we have an uneven number of people, so they're all just going to be buzzing in together. Um, three different teams. So, we're doing food. We buzz via phones. We're not being rude. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm being rude. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, Get off Twitter. <laughs> we are doing food. Uh, and there is some, there's a little, little give and take with what I really mean by food. Right. Um, so Twizzlers are not a food. They're barely. A candy. They're actually, I think there is a, we candy. just saw that movie. We saw what? Twizzlers. Mm-hmm. Oh, Twisters. That's funny. That's funny. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> still waiting on your call, Glenn. So this is an eight round competition. Each round, if you've ever seen family feud, is going to be like this. I'm going to give them a prompt. So it's all done based on community surveys. I'm pulling these surveys from ranker.com. Hashtag so these are, these are real people voting on real things. Uh, and the community was given a prompt, you know, rank these things uh, based on how many people voted uh, will be what ends up being the top eight answers for each of these questions. So they're going to buzz in and whoever gives the highest ranked answer, it will be their turn. <laughs> they're going to guess as many of the correct answers as possible. If they get three incorrect answers, uh, the other two players can buzz in and steal the points. I don't do well under pressure. All right. So, <laughs> good, just for good the good record. To good to know. All right, we got the game board behind us. So, round one. In a survey pulled from Ranker.com, the audience was polled, if you could only eat one food for the rest of your life, what would it be? Buzz? What the hell? Oh, that's <laughs> not true. true. All right. So, in a survey of over 438,000 votes. Wow. Jesus. Get on our level, family. Food. Christian. Yes. What are one of the eight foods that people voted on? Um, How do you not know? There's also a There's eight foods. Why not? There's also a um, Just saying. <laughs> Too late. Spaghetti. Spaghetti. That's what you went with. Yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> that's crazy. That is incorrect. You guys can buzz in. Not even on the list. That's not <laughs> buzz. I think Josh was second. Yeah, I was second. Josh. I'm going to go with pizza, Corey. That was mine. Pizza is the number one answer. Oh. Woo! Wow. I was going to pick pizza. So Josh. Josh. Spaghetti. <laughs> it's close. Tortellini, Corey. <laughs> <laughs> So, Josh, it is your game, so you can keep guessing until you get three wrong. And bear with me, I'm learning this interface. It's a whole different thing than we did last time. So. Okay, bear okay. with me, I've forgotten all food. Um, all right, so in the survey of foods that you could eat for the rest of your life. What burgers. That's up there. Good answer, good answer. Yeah, there, there it is. Yeah. Now it feels like <laughs> good answer. That is the number six answer. Okay. Um... How specific is the list? It's actually very like general. Okay. Uh, Chinese food. That is a number five answer. Wow. Wow. Um, Ooh, ah. Tacos. That's good. That is the number four answer. Um, ice cream. That is not on the list. Strike one. Wah. Damn. Wah, wah. Like sound effects. I was going to say, Nick's sound <laughs> yeah, effects you're sound are going to effect be Thank superior you. to... Uh, ooh. Uh, I pred- predict breakfast. Ooh, that that's a good one. It's not on the list. Ooh, they said it. it's on my list. I think one more. Got, every more meal could be breakfast for me. One hundred percent. Um, pasta. 
Pasta is the number two answer. Very good. I said spaghetti. Come on now. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> that is fair. Actually, objectively, I feel like Christians. Yeah, I probably. <laughs> but still, though, Josh had the number one answer. Yeah, but so. like he yeah. said pasta. Like that's really <laughs> <laughs> Which spaghetti is a pasta. And Josh still would have had the number one answer. So. Maybe y'all can split with you. Um, okay. Um, Three more. And one more incorrect guess. I've forgotten all food. Um, 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 steak. Dang, that is the number eight answer. Ooh, that's not what I thought eight was. Um, am I gonna sweep the board? Um, do 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 Sushi. Sushi is incorrect. That is not on the list. So, so Nick, the board is yours. The number three and the number seven place answers are still up for grabs. I'm going to go with my gut. I'm going to say, oh, this is a good game to go with your gut. I'm going to say salad. Ooh, that's what you would eat for the rest of the salad. No, not me. I'm thinking of the white people. The people is not on the list. Uh, Uh So. Um, Joshua gets the 400 point. So Josh gets the 400 points. Congrats. You guys want to know what the other two answers are? We do. Where's the soundboard? We need audience. Where's the audience? It'll be added in and post. <laughs> All right. The number seven answer. Chicken. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> that is too vague. Continue. Take, taking this card. And the number three answer. <laughs> yeah. Fruit. Fruit. What the? Fruit. <laughs> what the? Fruit. <laughs> what the? <fruit? laughs> All right, round Deep two. Studio ban. In a survey oh, of over 207,000 votes. Ringer. The best movie theater snacks. What the f- <laughs> <laughs> Got the fast thumbs, baby. Christian. If you don't say the, the number one, <laughs> we're going to fight. Raisinets. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> that is incorrect. That is not on the list. Nick. Nick's still recovering. <laughs> corn, Corey. Popcorn. <laughs> Popcorn is the number one answer. <laughs> That's very funny. That's my number one. Ah. Forget y'all. All right, Nick. In a survey of over 207,000 votes, name some of the best movie theater snacks. Nachos, Corey. Nachos are not on the list. Oh, okay. Oh, ooh, interesting. Right. Where did these people go to the movie? <laughs> yeah. Um, want to say Twizzlers, Corey, or candy, general candy? Uh, this is. Uh, I'll, I'll go ahead and tell you, it's not general, so it's okay. very specific. Twizzlers, Corey. Twizzlers are not on the list. Who made this list? Um, two hundred seven thousand people, people are wrong. <laughs> They're all in LA. Uh. It's hard when it's you. I mean, it's fine. I just I feel like nachos and Twizzlers should run. Yeah, it really. Should <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go with cookie dough balls, Corey. Wow, wow. cookie dough balls. Yeah, yeah. Little cookie, cookie dough bites. Thing. Yeah. The bites. Thank you. Yep, cookie dough balls on your not. I know. <laughs> so, Josh, I don't know what the fudge <laughs> I'm gonna say, but <laughs> okay. Cheeks. Um, Blue cheeks. Emma M's. That's good. M and M's are the number four answer. So he gets all the points Um, because he stole. There we go. That uh, Twizzlers really is not on there. I'm very curious to see what else is on this list. This is going to piss me off. In a poll on Ranker.com out of over 207,000 votes, the number eight answer of the best movie theater snacks, Reese's Pieces. That's fair. Okay. Reese's Pieces. Reese's Pieces. (laughs) <laughs> Reese. The name is Reese. Whatever. Reese. I've never had them, so I don't care. <laughs> Corey would die. The number seven answer Skittles. Hmm. The number six answer Kit Kats. Which never, I don't never, agree with. What? But never had a, never had a kick out of the movie. I've never even seen it no. in a movie theater. That's so messy. Butterfinger. I bet Butterfinger's on there. Uh, Butterfinger. The number five answer Ices. Mm, that's I a do, drink. I do love an Icy. It says you can sort of spoon it. <laughs> you can spoon it. Be on my 
The number three <laughs> answer, Sour Patch Kids. Okay. Sour Patch Kids are so mid. If yeah. you guys hated Icy, you're going to hate number two. Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wow. All right, so Josh got some points for that. That's stupid. Not the points, but the... Ugh. M&M's was a good choice, though. Raisin Nets are so good. All right, round number three. I'll get that pack that's very much meant for families mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. destroy it. Mm-hmm. Crushed. Yep, easily. Before the previews are done. <laughs> All <laughs> right. It's like eating a brick of chocolate. Oh. In a survey on Ranker.com. What in the world? The most memorable smells from the mall. Oh, I got this. I <laughs> swear to God, I tapped it 84 times. Just let Christian go first. Every time. <laughs> I just so now good. got your buzz. <laughs> <laughs> I was sitting. <laughs> <laughs> That's probably the problem. Uh, so in a survey on Ranker.com of over 40,000 votes, Christian. What is one of the most memorable smells from a mall? Christian's going to be like Popcorn. cleaning supplies. Oh, OK. <laughs> <laughs> Popcorn. Is the number two answer? Hey, hey. I'm good. All right, I'm next, though, right? Uh, yeah, are you? I'm gonna say Auntie Anne's uh, pretzels. It's a good answer. It's a good answer. Or Sabaro. Yeah, Sabaro would have been good. Or but American I'll... Cookie. Mmm. Pretzels. 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 It's pretzels. the number four answer. Hey. All right. All right. Hey. Right. Josh. Do I get to do it? We have I, mean, to see, I guess technically, yeah. We have to see we have who to, is the higher. The oh, yeah, because usually yeah. there's only two teams. Right, yeah. right, right. Okay. Um, you said you had it. I know it's been like 20 years since we've been to a mall, but. I know, right? The. um, It's been. Cinnabon. That's Ooh. a great choice. Oh, Josh. I'm upset. Cinnabon is the number one answer. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. Garbage. That's awesome. <laughs> I got one. <laughs> All right, so in a survey of over 40,000 votes, name the rest of the top eight of the most memorable smells in them all. Uh, <laughs> I have one, but it's probably not on the list. Reason it. Um, <laughs> um, the smell of weed from the, um, <laughs> not Hot, hot Topic, topic uh, but Spencer's the gift. Spencers, yeah. Spencers. <laughs> The smell of weed is not on the list. No, he was much more specific. <laughs> Pretty lame. Um, <laughs> I don't know. I feel like we nailed the three smells of them all. Um, New shoes. Yeah. I know I'm thinking food, but I guess that's not necessarily the only things you smell at the mall. Correct. So I did say it was some give and take with food for this category. Yeah. It's food heavy, but not all food. I'm food heavy. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm heavy from food. <laughs> it's actually in my stat list. <laughs> food heavy. Um, I kind of wish I didn't win. I have no idea. Um, in in real life, there is a timer, right? Mm-hmm. Like mm-hmm. I would probably. be out of time by now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let's just say I'm out of time. That's the sound it makes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, meh, meh. yeah. So Christian. Yes. Since Josh striked out. Struck out? Struck out? Struck? <laughs> you had the number two answer in movie theater okay, popcorn. The past tense. You have the opportunity to steal the board if you get one more correct answer. So. Hmm, 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 hmm. Most memorable smells from the mall. You got this. Perfume. Ooh, that's, that's a good. good one. Corey. You know what? I'll give it to you. Air so, in favor. Yeah. Or this will be the lamest game ever. <laughs> Bath and Body Works. Ah, Number three yeah, answer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, yeah, that's count very that. specific. That's yeah. 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 All right. So uh, to finish out that that round, the number eight answer for, for uh, most memorable oh. smells from the mall, <laughs> Panda Express. I was going to say Chinese place. Okay. The number Food. seven answer. Yeah, that's good. Ooh. Yankee Candle. Yankee Candle. Wow. The number six answer, the mall fountain. Who's That's, sniffing the fountain? I, don't know. I guess it had a metallic smell for all the pennies. And the number five answer, <laughs> Sbarro. Sbarro. Yeah, Nick said that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I should have thought about the food court. I didn't yeah. think about yeah. the food court. Yeah. I just thought about the individual little places. I was going to Cin- say Cinnabon leather. was great. That was a good. Yeah. That was good. Let's say, uh, what was it? Madison Square Mall? It just mm. smelled like leather. All right. Yeah. Round <laughs> number four. Best fast Ooh, food. Oh, this is fun. Food. Okay. Okay. Christian, let me go first. <laughs> this is a smaller poll 
Uh, so from over 3,000 votes, name the best fast food mascots. The best is a weird qualifier. Is it best or most popular? Mm-hmm. Ooh. Josh got in there first, but like I'd be pushing it, and it my don't screen be... went dark right before. <laughs> <laughs> I think that what that's what got me the last two times is I was technically not. So Josh, in a survey of over three thousand votes, Taco Bell dog Corey three thousand. That's a weird first choice. The Chihuahua. That is a good guess, but unfortunately not on the list. That was a weird first choice. Okay. We're in 2024. No one knows the Chihuahua dog anymore. Yeah, so, Christian. She's been dead. Get a Taco Bell. Christian, you're second one to buzz in. Best fast food mascots. Ronald McDonald. Yeah, I'm not sure why I didn't go with that one first. But Clowns make me uncomfortable. <laughs> that is the number four answer. Wow. wow. Who four? beat out old Ronnie? Hmm? So, Nick, you have an opportunity. Hmm. Fast food. Oh, Wendy. From Wendy's. Yes. <laughs> Wendy is the number two answer, so Nick, you have the board. There's your thumbnail. <laughs> um, it's like it's pooping. <laughs> <laughs> Can I say Ving Rames from Arby's? <laughs> is that wow. your no, guess? Okay. No. Is he really we the have guy? the meat. <laughs> um, a KFC guy. Colonel, the Colonel. The Colonel. The Colonel. Colonel. Colonel Sanders is the number one answer. Ah, hey. Um, How loose are we using the term fast food? Um, I want to say the Noid. From top oh, I'll give you a hint. There is one pizza place on here, but the rest are fast food. I knew it. Oh, Chucky from Chuck E. Cheese. <laughs> That's not fast food. Incorrect. <laughs> that's on the list. Oh, I know who the pizza person is. Me too. Do you? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Do you? Charles. Papa John. <laughs> no. Oh, oh. <laughs> I was going to really say Papa John. <laughs> I would have felt like ass. All right. Uh, <laughs> no, Nick, what'd you say? Uh, I, was, I just said Charles E. Cheese. That's all. It's not, I was being dumb. Um, I was in charge. Fast food restaurant. Um, I will say not all of them are local to us. Yeah, I, yeah. Oh. Can I say Jared from Subway? Oh my god, please just not around any children. That. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's true. Um, dang. I guess I should clarify these are not real people mascots. Like these are not supposed pe- spokes yeah. people. These are Oh, all right, characters. All right. Okay. Colonel Sanders was a real person. Well, he's been dramatized. Okay caricatured traumatized <laughs> Nick, <laughs> what we, happened to the we chicken need to, we need to get you going here um, i'm working on it man i don't for how long is that timer oh, wait uh oh, that gum um um the purple thing the purple thing can you name Pokey? a restaurant i can cookie monster no no cookie monster's know. blue I know, oh. what you're, I know what you're saying, um, but I want to give it to you. Yeah, give gr- me the rest. Grimace, 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 <laughs> Grimace is the number seven answer. I went through all the vowels. <laughs> <laughs> Grimace, the hamburger. Grimace. The hamburger is the number six answer. Um, that doesn't seem fair. McDonald's, McDonald's has a lot. I know McDonald's got a whole crew. Yeah. Um, I don't know I'm others. sure that I feel like there's one more. Wasn't there a McNugget? There's three more. A yeah, McNugget. Yeah, there's a there's a whole gang of them. Yeah, yeah. But I don't. That's probably not. Oh, well, Ronnie has a whole retinue. <laughs> Insane clown posse. Um, <laughs> uh, does the star from Hardy's count? The little star guy. <laughs> Did he have a name? Okay, at a certain it's point, we have to yeah, say that's a wrong just... answer. <laughs> I don't know his. I don't. I'm, I'm going to say the star from Hardy's. I don't know his name. Uh, that is not on the list. The Carl star Jr. guy from Hardy's is not on the list. <laughs> his name is Carl Jr. Um, <laughs> my last one. Hopefully, I'll miss these two. It's a pizza one. And apparently it's oh, not Papa John's. Pizza, pizza. Um, Little Caesars guy. That is the number three answer. Nice. nice. Okay, it being the number three answer is pizza. a little surprising. Yeah, for sure. Um, pizza, pizza. Fudge. Oh, yeah, he's Little Caesar. Mm-hmm. Not the Little Caesar. Yeah, no, I'm pizza, that pizza. from Popeye's. What's her <laughs> name? I feel like it's Coretta or something. Right? Yeah. Um, uh, I'm gonna. Uh, I can't think of any more. Um, num, 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 the last num. two are kind of weird. I will give you that. Little Debbie. 
that is not fast food, but that is, uh, guess, that is incorrect. I'm just, I'm banking on them not knowing it. Uh, so Christian, the board is up for you to steal all the points. At least 430 points up for grabs. Ooh. You have two more on the board. The number five answer and the number eight answer for the best fast food mascots. Fast food mascots. Oh, um, the Jolly Bee Bee. What? What? It's a fast food restaurant. Jolly Bee. No idea. It's not on the list. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were talking about the bee from the Cheerios commercial. No. Nah. <laughs> also not fast food. So, Josh, <laughs> you have the opportunity. Think Jack in the box. That is the number eight answer. Are you kidding me? Wow. Are you kidding me? Roll Tide. Um, Are you kidding me? So what's, Josh, number, what's number five? Josh gets 460 points. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Jack from Jack, Jack in the and Damn Box? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and the last answer, the number five answer was the cow oh, from Chick-fil-A. The hell Eat more here. chicken. <laughs> the ones they can't spell. Yes. Uh, Terrible penmanship. Terrible. <laughs> I am thoroughly upset. All right. <laughs> round number five. I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. This I one's to, this oh, one's a little off the I know who I would. All right. Which ex president wow. would you go on a bender with? Got it. Josh actually did get it. So Josh. I know who I would. <laughs> Bill. Oh, that's a good choice. I'm assuming Bill Clinton. Yes. <laughs> William Jefferson Clinton. In a survey of over 6,000 votes. His name. <laughs> Is it really? Yeah. William Jefferson. I've never heard his middle name before. Yeah, Jefferson. Wow. Ah. He's from Arkansas. They... Bill Clinton's not on the list. Are you serious? Oh, wow. What a... I find that wildly disappointing. Yeah, that's not correct. Who, um, so just Nick, like... who did they survey? The RNC? <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, so, Nick, you had the second buzz? I want to say I'm George so W. Bush. George W. Bush is the number one answer. He doesn't drink anymore. <laughs> oh my God. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's what a bender is, is just coming out of retirement. <laughs> <laughs> so, Nick, the board is yours. Oh, um, my non alcoholic. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. <laughs> you're, you're wheezing. <laughs> Cracked uh, myself up. Sorry. Uh, I'm going to put the 45th president of these United States, Donald, what is it? John Trump. Yeah. I feel like he's on there. Trump. I'm not sure the J actually stands for anything. Trump is not on the list. John, like I mm. just said. Uh, to be clear, Joe Nathan. I'd go on a bender with Trump. Um, I feel like it'd be fun. Spared no I expense. Was say something <laughs> really bad. I'm going to not say that. Um, president. Yes. I got one in mind. <laughs> uh, I'm going to say. We're sure Bill wasn't on the list. He, he might have been further down, but we kept what? it at eight. Oh, that's wild. Okay. I want to say uh, Richard M. Nixon. Not on the list. Is that his middle initial? I'm impressed at your knowledge of middle initials. <laughs> I, yeah, I, I just, What's I, mine? I'm a cornucopia of useless information. Huh? What's mine? Jay. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I only know President Middle <laughs> It's a very niche set of <laughs> I will say Richard Nixon was the number 11 answer. Well, where was Bill? I just want to know. Had to be on the list. Um, he actually was not on the list. That's so That's weird crazy. to me. Yeah. You can do some cocaine with him. <laughs> um, you have one more? Fly off to an island? I'm going to say uh, John Fitzgerald Kennedy. That's the number two answer. So he was out there with Marilyn Monroe. It's a safe, right? yeah, safe answer. I was going to say, he'd bring some peeps. Mm-hmm. Um, I don't I'm, I'm going to say I have so many good answers now. Yeah. <laughs> but I was so certain mine was a good answer. Yeah. Buzzkill, man. <laughs> she was a buzzkill. Loosen um, up, Jackie. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to. Uh, um, At some point, we got to cap you because this is taking too long. <laughs> I'm going to say. I'm going to say. Um. Uh, what's the, no, the other three letter one uh, Franklin Delano Roosevelt that's the number five answer Tell some good polio stories wow uh, I'm gonna say call them wheels yeah Ow. yeah uh, Dwight D. Eisenhower he tells some good war stories Ooh, that would be a good answer but unfortunately not on well, that was I, I like Ike so Christian you have an opportunity to steal mm -hmm. five answers remain um which ex-presidents 
what do you want to go on a bender with? I don't like this list. This this shows how well listened in history class. FDR was on the list, but Bill Clinton wasn't. I'm sorry, I, I didn't make the list. Um, I'm mad at everyone who did. What's his um? The one that sounded like this, Willard oh, wow. Fillmore. <laughs> um, wait, no, the one they always did in SNL. Um, oh, HW. Nope, the other one, the Truman? skinnier one, Carter. Yeah, HW. Carter. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Carter. Uh, he was he was further, a submarine captain. He was further down the list, but not in the top eight. He's still uh, alive too. He's still alive. So do I get to try again? Yes. Yes. Teddy. Ooh, that's a good one. That's the one with the mustache. Yep. That is a good one, and I'm surprised, but not in the top eight. What the hell? Who doesn't <laughs> want to get hammered and ride a moose? <laughs> so uh, is Nick Lincoln gets... on there somewhere? Huh? I feel is Lincoln on there somewhere? No, I'm sure it's mind blowing to hang out with him. Jefferson. So Nick gets the two fifty points. I don't. I, I want to see the rest of the list. If I got see the rest of the list? Thomas Jefferson, I'd beat the hell out of him. <laughs> <laughs> and a survey on Ranker.com of over how many points? How many? How many? Doesn't matter. So, Quick, uh, six thousand votes. Which ex-president would you go on a bender with? Number eight answer, Chester Arthur. Who who the, picked Chester the, A. Arthur? He had the I mean the chops. I was gonna uh, say people with chops can throw down. The number seven answer, James Buchanan. I feel like Didn't we die just made this list up. The number what six answer, this is <laughs> Franklin Pierce. He definitely died in office. Forgot he was a president. Who picked these people? Number four answer, James Adam or John Adams. There was two. Which one? The good that's was there two there was or the was second, there's the second or was he just president twice? Uh, there was the second president. He was he was um, Washington's vice president, and then there was I think the fifth president was another John Adams. There was John Quincy Adams, and then there was another John. Yeah, Adams. Oh yeah, that's right. This is okay. I just be knowing president stuff. I know. I'm really impressed. <laughs> Things. <laughs> this is the founding father one. Okay. I don't. I don't want to be. There. I'm glad. And the number three answer, Ulysses S. Grant. That's a good answer. Ulysses S. Grant. Together. He was an amazing general and not a great president. Yeah. He did the Transcontinental Railroad. According, One of my favorite uh, bumper stickers I've seen list. in a while, though, uh-huh. well, it had a picture of George Washington. It was a quote from him, mm-hmm. but it said, me and my homies would have been stacking bodies by now. <laughs> Jesus. Wow. Well, All right, right. Round number six. I got points. Oh, wait. Hold on. Let me turn my phone on. Uh, All right. Ooh. All right. I'm ready. They went dark. And a survey of over... 388,000 votes. The best cereal of all time. Christian was I on keep, it. I keep doing this. I hit <laughs> uh-huh. it, you can't drive. It has to be a direct tap. Like a big yeah. dummy. Christian. We play them games. Baby. In a survey of over 300,000 votes, mm-hmm. name one of the best cereals of all time. Oh man, uh, cinnamon toast crunch. It's a good answer. Good answer. It's good, good answer. Good answer. Good, good, answer. answer. good answer. Show us cinnamon toast crunch. <laughs> you made a game. <laughs> All right, right. I do it seven more times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, you have seven more answers. Um, he just forgot. Frosty cereal. <laughs> Frosted Flakes. A solid choice. Safe Number choice. two. Choice. Hey, you're going in order. Mm-hmm. Uh, with the bananas in it. That's, right. that's <laughs> important. No, that's not good. That's one. important. <laughs> um, Raisin Bran. Dude, that's my favorite. Raisin Brahms. Raisin no, Bran. You don't have to watch that commercial with Brahms. Is that your actual answer? Yeah. yeah. Raisin Bran, not on the list. That's stupid. It should be. It's good. It's um, the old people cereal. Mm-hmm. Lots of fiber. Special K. Mm -hmm. Good poops. (laughs) I have been eating eating a lot of Raisin Bran. Koshi? Or Kashi? Christian. That's not not my answer. (laughs) (laughs) You do need to have an answer pretty soon. (laughs) Um, Note um, to self, um, we need an actual timer. Fruit Loops. Loops. Fruit Loops. Good answer. answer. That's the number six answer. Let's go. That's low, but okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, Fruity Pebbles. Yeah, I was Good. about to sing the Flintstones theme song. Number five answer. Good. Uh, pops? What? Pops. Oh, the yellow? Oh, yeah. The yeah. Yellow, yellow pops. I love Pops. I used to eat them things. Uh, you mean corn you. Pops? No. Corey. Just Pops. What the hell is it Pops? I don't think it was Pops. Yeah, it was it's, it's corn Pops. Pops are the yellow box. Yeah. 
Is it on the list or not? It is not on the list. (laughs) (laughs) That's the real thing. (laughs) Yeah, Pops. Pops. I remember Pops. Yeah. I thought they were called Corn Pops. Nope. No, that's a different thing. Yeah, that's Joe Biden. That's (laughs) (laughs) K-Pop. Corn Pop. Remember that? Sorry. Anyway, you have one more guess. (laughs) Um... Um, 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 all right, zero, go down the aisle mm-hmm. and he's going through his mind palace to the cereal aisle. Magically delicious. He just gave it to you. I almost forgot what it's called. Lucky Charms. Okay. Lucky Charms is the number seven. <laughs> well, we're singing jingles. Um, I'm about to shake you. <laughs> <laughs> um, Is, are there multiple of the same like cereal? different variations? No. Yeah. no. Oh. Okay. Okay. Um uh, da, 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 da. Oops, all marshmallows. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, regular cornflakes. That is not on the list. Oh, that's done. So my turn. Uh Josh, you have the opportunity to steal the board. Cheerios. Honey Nut Cheerios is the number three answer. <laughs> uh huh. Um, so, f- well, that's it. <laughs> <You've had laughs> to steal. Oh, that's all I had to do was just steal it? Oh, okay. What are the other two? I want to know. Wait, is uh, Cookie Crisp on there? Cookie no. Crisp. Rice Krispie Treat, or Rice Krispies, though, right? All right. In a survey of over 388,000 votes, the best cereals of all time, the number eight answer Cocoa Pebbles. Garbage. <laughs> Those are so gross. Just Garbage. Trash. And the number yeah. four answer. Cookie crisp. Captain Crunch. Oh. Captain Crunch. Crunch. I didn't even think of that. I didn't. Berry licious. Yeah. Yeah, I said oops all berries. That's them, where it comes from. Yeah. Get, ah, I'm just some peanut butter joints out of here. <laughs> all right, round number seven. In Ooh. a survey of over 150,000 oh, votes, man. the best fast food French fri- French fries? French fries. Can we work together on this one? What? No, that's <laughs> not how the game works. Oh. Ah, I don't understand. <laughs> Christian. I just Do you just not have a screen protector or I something? Got is that what it is? It's less, less than tensile. Yeah. Um, McDonald's. It's a good basic people answer. McDonald's is the number one answer. Yep. Yep. Yeah. So do that. Board is yours. Um, five guys. Ooh, that's solid, good. solid Very guess. Good. That's the number four answer. I like that they give you a whole bag, right? I don't think no, how much it no matter what. I know. It, well, it, for twenty dollars, they ought to give me. All that's true. <laughs> yeah. uh, the Burger King. Burger Burger King. You were not on the list. What? what? Wow. I mean, fair. You know what is it? They are trash. Yeah, they're not like that them. great. But I, weren't I they great they when we were little though? They well, were. They the form, like they yeah. used to be really, really. They good. used to be crisp solid, back yeah. then. That's Fresh. solid. Um, it might have been further down the list, but the Wendy's fry. Mm. Ooh, those natural cut fries. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Wendy's with the sea salt. Not on the list. Crazy. Word. Didn't mean a frosty. Okay, so uh, again, another clue. Is it? Non-regional. Oh, I got one. Restaurants. I got a good one. Um, I got a good one. Yeah, I know the one. All but one. I got a good one. It's around here. All but one? Mm-hmm. So these are all that are in easy driving distance. Obviously, so. Captain D's. They're yeah. actually not bad. <laughs> <laughs> I like Captain That's that fish grease on there. Um, <laughs> tastes a little bit like a hush puppy. Yeah. Our bays. Our bays. Our bays. Good answer. Good that answer. fine. The number two answer. That was mine. Very good. Curly fries. Wait, mm-hmm. they have two different fries. So, mm-hmm. sorry. Go ahead. We all ignore that they have crinkle fries now. <laughs> yeah. If we're not getting curly fries, why the hell are we going to Arby's? That's a good also, point. why are we going to Arby's? They're roast meat. Cheddar roast they have meat. the yeah. meat. They have the meats. I have never. They even have cheeseburgers. In my years of living, I've literally never had a roast beef sandwich from there. You should I have The cheddar roast beef is pretty solid. It looks disgusting. Back in the day, we used to go there for chicken tendies and fries, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Solid. I'd get the chicken tenders. Oh, the the Florence, You're making me Cox want Creek. Arby's now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's very good. After this, are we going to go get Arby's? I might, actually. No. Okay. Christian, come on. <laughs> um, <laughs> You're stalling. Uh, restaurant, fast food restaurant, fries. Yes, uh, that is. Panda I a, Express. I got another good one. Whataburger. 
Mm. Really? You think so? No. No one else does. Uh, uh, in and out. In and out. In and out. <laughs> Josh. Josh, you have the opportunity to still. Chick-fil-A. Waffle fries. Damn it, that was mine. Chick-fil-A is the number three answer. Waffle fries. For, for free. free. <laughs> <laughs> so Josh gets 340 points. Oh, Surprise, oh. mother. <laughs> All right. So to finish this out, in a survey of over 150,000 votes, best French fries. Unforgivable. The number eight answer, Red Robin. Get out of here. Red Robin. I mean, they are limitless and get them with little campfire sauce. They're pretty, the steak fries. Are mm-hmm. The number seven answer, Jack in the Box. I hate Jack. Jack. Jack's back again. I hate Jack. The number six answer, Popeyes. I mean, they're pretty yeah. good. Yeah, the Cajun, Cajun fries. fries. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you guys agree. <laughs> All right. And the number five answer, rallies slash checkers. Actually... Do we still have that one checkers? It's still yeah. there. <laughs> yeah. okay. Back, still in, there? back in the nineties, actually, when they just were changing their grease all the time. Mm-hmm. We had a rallies right by my childhood home. We tear it up in the Lewis. Mm-hmm. I lived out in Aniston. Yeah, we rallies. Mm-hmm. All right. Rally. To finish up this this episode, oh, yeah. we have one more round. Try it. Try it again. And a survey. On Ranker.com of over 226,000 votes. Eat it out. Eat it out. <laughs> the audience was... still wasn't on the list. Sorry. The audience was surveyed the best fast food <laughs> burger. Now, before we vote, I will say, uh, the original list had multiple burgers from multiple places. I reduced it down to be one burger per place. So this is... So, so this we is have just to... the place. Okay. okay. I was going to okay. say, okay. do we have to guess the specific burger? No. The are just doing a burger. Just doing the QPC. Yeah. QPC. So okay. I simplified quarter, it. Quarter pound just of cheese. Best. Yeah. Burger. They really want us to call it a QPC now. I don't like that. You guys ready? Yeah. Oh, your screen's yeah. ready. I'm gonna call it a mama. No, table. it's not. Okay, get, get your screen ready. Open. Open. All right, ready. Here we go. <laughs> Nick got it. All right. <laughs> I, I, was last thumb. I was robbed. Yeah, Nick is about the thumb. Best fast food burger in general. The restaurant. McDonald's, Corey. No. McDonald's is not on the list. Whoa. Good list. Yeah. Burgers from McDonald's. Like a real list? Yeah, that's a real list. <laughs> <laughs> He's so upset. You gotta search for why that's not the answer. You mean to tell me the one time you got in? The one time <laughs> I get in first. And the most obvious answer is not <laughs> one of the top eight. Okay. All right. So, Christian. Yeah. yeah. Sorry, Nick. Um, wait, best fast food burger? The place, yeah. Shake Shack. Yes. So Shake Shack is actually the one I had to type her on. So that's actually going to be our number three answer. You're welcome. It says five guys, but that is Shake Shack. So, so it's five guys actually on the list? Can't tell you. Can't tell you. Well, no, but what I'm saying is since that says five guys, is it still possible for it to be on the list? Why wouldn't it be? Because it says it right there. <laughs> <laughs> I guess what I'm asking is, is it possible for five guys to apparently be on this list twice? Yes. Okay. So Josh, you still have the opportunity. But I don't think it's five guys. Um, what would basic people say the answer is? I would say McDonald's. McDonald's. Yeah. <laughs> is what they would say. <laughs> Burger King. All right. Burger King is not on the list. So, Christian, oh. the board is yours. I would say five guys at this point. Five guys. <laughs> <laughs> so five guys is the number one answer. <laughs> I zoned out for a second. Uh, <laughs> Wendy's. Wendy's. Square Wendy's patties. Wendy's is the number five answer. That sounds fair. Um, McDonald's. Jack in the Box. Might Jack well. in the Box is not on... Oh, the list. word. Same, Finally. <laughs> um, what are burger places? Uh, in and out. In and out is the number two answer. As it should be. That is a tasty burger. <laughs> it's okay. A big kahuna burger. Um, Royal cheese. Four uh, more answers remain. Who has served burgers? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> We're at that point. Oh, uh, what a what a burger. 
Unfortunately, a Whataburger is the number six answer. <laughs> wow. I hate Whataburger. I do. It's not good. It's trash. It's Texas, good. get over it, dude. <laughs> it's Whataburger is not that good. It's big. It's not good. It's not good. It's, it's been you have Bucky's. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, you want mustard on your burger? No. Well, you, you're getting it anyway. <laughs> Um, 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 I really should put a timer on you guys. <laughs> it's, it's, I'm trying to imagine all the places I pass by. <laughs> I will say the rest of the answers are here in town. Wrap it up. Arby's? They don't have they burgers. Just, they just added burgers. Why would that be on the list? <laughs> Arby's is not on the list. Do have burgers? When, when did they make this list? How like, was that only two X's? <laughs> <laughs> um okay uh here in town i'm new in town uh, <laughs> applebee's applebee's is not on the list so that's very funny uh <laughs> captain <D's. laughs> captain <D's. laughs> so i guess it goes back to uh me Nick. Um, yeah, Nick. real quick off top of the dome i must just so this can be over uh hardy's <laughs> Hard- hardy's hardy's I actually do like a thick burger, but unfortunately, Hardee's is not on the list. Wow. So Christian gets the points. Yay. Is Sonic on the list? Oh, I forgot about Sonic. Because they're so awful. <laughs> so in the survey of over 226,000 votes over on Ranker.com, the best fast food burgers, the number eight answer, Red Robin. Yum. <laughs> Also, I just don't feel like Red Robin is a fast food. Yeah, eater. it is it's not. It's a sit down restaurant. Fast, fast and fast casual. and loose. Fast casual. Yeah. Playing fast and loose with fast food. The number seven answer: Steak and Shake. Mm, I didn't oh, think about that. Those I do like good. Steak and Shake. Yeah. I always forget about those. Mm-hmm. I love Steak and Shake. That make good of beans. And the number those four answer. Amazing. Number four answer. KFC. Culver's. <gasps> the Culver's. butter burger. Culver's is solid. I like the shrimp. So never had it. It's really good. <laughs> Congratulations, Josh. Yay. Yay. You win the game. Yay. You know your foods. In case you didn't notice. <laughs> bam, bam, bam. Congrats. You won by a landslide. So good job. Good Thanks. job. How does this make you feel? Thanks. Like I need to eat less. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, thank you for tuning in. Uh, I hope this turns out better in post than it does right now. Right now. Lots of editing. Lots of editing. So thank you for tuning in. If you like this, please go Head on over to youtube.com slash at Eat Sleep Nerd. Click subscribe. Click like. Go watch our other videos. Click like. Uh, comment on this video. Our other videos. If you got some thoughts, opinions, share us with your friends. Christian. Mm-hmm. Our second place loser. It's first place loser. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> yeah. What are three things nerds should be doing before they go watch the rest of our channel? Let folks know that uh, Red Robin is not a fast food restaurant. Yeah. 200... 88,000 people. Jack in the box. <laughs> they have tacos. That's weird. Yeah, it's weird. They're it's like weird. $2 a piece. It's, it's just weird. It's weird. Yeah. That's too I don't much trust for that. a taco. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> Especially when it's just chopped up burger meat. Like, <laughs> like, <laughs> that even tastes like a taco. Yeah. <laughs> it's an alternative way of eating a hamburger. Maybe that's their point. Eat sleep nerds. Eat sleep nerds. Take it easy, people.